guys, um, welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to show you how to make um, my little village, my little, my village's ice cream stand. So what you're going to need is a bed of any kind. I'll use a cyan, well, look, excuse me, we'll use the pink bed and need a, need a flower pot next. Which somewhat won't work, but you, you also need a spruce trapdoor. So now grab your um flower pot, and then grab a flower of any kind. We'll use the corn flower for a little example. Next, you need a furnace, a glass furnace, a smoker, white stained glass panes. Stripped spruce wood. A chest. A dark oak door. A crafting table. Lantern. Copstone walls. Stone, stone slabs, stone stairs, a daylight sensor, carpets of any kind. We're going to use light blue and white. You also need barrier blocks which I have access to. But let's just put away all of our random stuff that we don't need. Okay, next, you also need you also need just an ice cream bin, which you can find videos on how to do it, which I will show you how to. But we'll get the die on later. So let's put this away, and let's just check. Well, we're also doing how to make the idea board, so you might also need this along with some spruce slabs for the roof. But we're going over here. Well, we don't really need to do the idea board because it will be over there, but we do need spruce slabs. So we're, we're going over here. So we're going to start with the front of the building, which includes stone stairs. So, make sure it's tilted like this. Well, I don't really know how to pronounce the word, but still. We also might need some grass and dirt and sand in case you, re you run out of space to, to use for the building. So I'll just keep it in my inventory. So next you place a, a slab here. Then you place your next set of stairs. Like this. Now, if you go back over here, you will also have to repeat, this, repeat it again. So, so if we quickly rush back and we do that, so next, um, place your daylight detector right here. You can change it if you right click here, it changes. To blue, if you right click here, it changes to 
a little coconut white color. But next, you take your little white stained glass and you place it like this. Yeah, I have to rush back over because I keep forgetting how to do it. This is just my like third time building it because I built like two buildings. So, stone, okay. So you place it back here. So that's three. Now you take your little things. I have to keep going back because I keep forgetting how it looks. But if we rush back over. We have a cobblestone wall here. Spruce wood here, and then we just have a wall on top of it. I just have to make sure. One, two, three, yep. So three. Three of those. Place your cobblestone wall here, and take your... Come on, where is it? You have to grab it from here because we can't find it. So place three here. Yeah, as as you can see, I'm running out of space, so I'm just gonna have to build some extra terrain. Okay, there. So your cobblestone wall here. So now you do the same thing with the other side. Wall. Then you take some spruce planks, which I forgot to do earlier. And you also take some dark oak planks for the inside. So. So you place it like this, and you place your door right here, and then just place these right here. Place, well I don't know, but okay. Take your space trap doors, and place them right here. Raise it up to. Hold on, how high was it? I keep having to rush over. So, so it's this high. So it's five, five blocks high, and then you place the barrier block right there. Grab your white stained glass panes. <sighs> Did it wrong. Yeah, I did that wrong, like... But you go over here, so you place like three of them right here. Like that. And then do this. So that's your front part. And then place your barrier block up here. Like this. Then just put, take your little thing. And then over here. So so then you start with the light blue wool and then go or or any or any kind of carpet. So then you place it like this. 
and then you build over here. Yeah, I might have to make part two in this, but okay. So then you place your rotary blocks over here. Place your wool right here. Wait, wait, how do you get barrier blocks? Um, you just do to give your player name barrier block and then how much, how much, how many you want. I just gave myself one. So you place, place it like this and then you got the front part done. Now, just go rush over here. For the house part, so you have to place a back wall here, which I which I've done, and then place five blocks here or six blocks here because of the idea board. So you rush over. So if I rush over back here, I put, I have to go place five blocks. Where's that? There. One, two, three, four. I have to add some more terrain. Okay, so. Yeah, so that's five. And re repeat the same thing right here. And then just do the same thing. So you place blocks right here and then take your glass pane as well your white stained glass panes and then just build it so I build it like this And then you just go ahead and place your double planks. So then you just, if I just rush, rush back over here, you have slabs right here. And the inside. So, so how do I do the inside real quick? I have to check. I might make a part two on this because it's really it's going really slow, and I don't want to waste anyone's time. But we just got a couple seconds left, so I'll finish this up, and then we can make part two on the inside. Well, let's see how, how fast I can do this. Okay, now you um, go down here. And then take your bed. Place it right here. And then you s it's a trap door in right here. Place your flower pot. Okay, I might have to make a part two on this. But. Okay. Hopefully, hopefully enjoy. Please.
Hope you enjoyed and be sure to like, subscribe. I don't really care if you subs subscribe or not. Sorry if it's going too fast because we're already at 15 minutes and, and my little maximum for this is like 15 minutes. But I was able to get past the f 15 minute point. So uh, yeah, but anyways, bye.